you didn't have to work on Sundays, what would, what would you do? Well, that's been the case for the last several weeks. So uh, usually what I do is get up, have coffee, uh, try to watch uh, uh, any uh, news briefly because I don't spend a whole lot of time right now watching the news. It tends to be the same kind of thing. But, uh, and then watch Pulaski Heights United Methodist Church. That's <laughs> what I would do on Sunday morning. If I uh, were not preaching on Sunday morning, I would tune in every week and watch Pulaski Heights and be their biggest fan. <laughs> Uh, ditto. <laughs> uh, I I've, uh, uh, would probably, well, in, in the world of COVID, uh, watch church. Um, but uh, certainly Sunday mornings, I, I can't I can't imagine not not attending church. Um, but uh, uh, it would be you know doing it from home with with a cup of coffee and um, and uh, and and family there. That would be that would be nice. <laughs> Do you like roller coasters? No, not at all. Zero. No, I don't like roller coasters. Not good for my stomach. <laughs> I love roller coasters. <laughs> Do you have a favorite? Um, the last time, um, I guess I remember riding on a big one uh, was um, a few years ago. My family went to, down to Orlando and did Universal Studios. Um, and uh, Harry Potter, the, in the Harry Potter world, um, the, the Gringotts uh, experience um, is, is a, a lot of fun, a, a lot of fun. If you could have any superhero power, what would it be? Kathleen? Oh, goodness. I'd love to be able to fly. Um, I'm not a fan of traffic. Um, <laughs> so, uh, so being able to fly would, uh, would be pretty fantastic. John? Well, having lived in Houston, I would love to fly as well because traffic <laughs> is a royal nightmare. So I think probably flying. Do you know your Enneagram number? Uh, I used to know what it is. It's whatever type A impatient uh, driven personalities are, whatever that number is. I used to know it. Um, I know some of the other things. I'm an ESFJ on the Myers-Briggs. I, I don't remember the Enneagram. I've done it, but it's been a number of years ago. Kathleen? Uh, I'm a one on the Enneagram and uh, ENFJ for Myers-Briggs. Okay. <laughs> what is your favorite place that you have traveled? My favorite place is England. Anywhere in England, uh, I, I love, uh, I've done a couple of the Wesley tours, and I just love England in general. So anywhere on uh, that island is a, a blessing for me, and I enjoy every minute of it. Okay. Um, I, I've done a lot of traveling. I love to travel. Um, it's one of my, my passions. Um, looking forward to when we can do that again. Um, but... Uh, my favorite would have to be Thailand. Um, I, after living there for nine months, um, it, it, it has a piece of my heart, um, the, the people and the culture, and um, there's, a, there's a piece of my heart that's still there after, after living there for nine months. Do you drink the milk in the bowl after eating cereal? I do not. I give it to Henry, our dog, <laughs> and he drinks the meal in the bowl after I eat the cereal. No. <laughs> Do you have any hidden talents? If I have any hidden talents, they are even hidden from me. So uh, I'm not sure what those would be. Uh, I can play hot cross buns and Mary had a little lamb on the harmonica. So that's probably about the extent of my hidden talents. I was a part of the Parkview High School mime troupe. Um, so I was a mime in high school here in Little Rock, yes. So We miming. look forward to seeing more of that. <laughs> yeah, really. That's a, literally a hidden talent. <laughs> what is your favorite breakfast food? I think bacon and eggs probably for me, just a good old... Actually, I would have to say that's not true. My favorite is biscuits and gravy. Lots and lots of gravy. All that... 
gravy that's not good for you. That's absolutely my favorite. Can I? French toast made with like really good bread. What is your favorite musical, Kathleen? <laughs> Hamilton. I had a chance to see it um, on Broadway, and then I also uh, saw it in Memphis uh, when it was there last year. Just, I would see it umpteen times. I love it. I would say Hamilton as well. We saw it in Houston, and I was uh, incredibly impressed. I was uh, not that excited about going. Seemed to be a lot of extra uh, energy and enthusiasm that I didn't get, but once it was over with, I got it fully. I would say Hamilton without question. Great musical.